So I am officially cutting out RDLs from my program. For some reason, every time I do a barbell RDL or whatever, anything that's stretching my hammies out, my left hamstring gets messed up. So I actually blew it out during the spring. Not completely, but fucked it up pretty bad during the spring during a baseball game that I was playing in. And it was fine for a couple weeks after that. And it was fine up all the way until two leg days ago when I did RDLs for the first time since. And for some reason when I do them, it's just, it re-aggravates something in my left leg. So really no point in doing it if it's gonna keep doing that. Luckily it's not even close to as severe as it was during the season when I injured it during that baseball game. So I could still obviously work out, do my regular weight through it. It doesn't hurt or anything. It just feels, it feels off. It feels very weird. Uh. Uh.
I'm on the third and final set of leg curls. I dropped down about 10 pounds. I really just want to feel it right here in this last set. The other two sets, it was like 10 to 12 reps. Kind of just going a little heavier. Make sure my hamstring is fine. You know, the left one I'm talking about. And this final rep, or rather final set, is going to be complete burnout. Really trying to keep the tension the entire time. I feel as if, if I lose that smooth curling motion on this and I get stuck and I have to kind of like jerk it, you probably saw my last rep of the previous set. I feel as if when I get that motion, I lose everything. I lose the contraction in my hamstrings and I just lose the mind-muscle connection. It's like it just doesn't feel good. So that I usually stop whenever that happens because there's no point in doing it if you can't feel it. And that's the whole point of working out. You want to be able to feel the muscle, right? So let's get into this. Yep, lost it.
Alright, so doing Bulgarians right now and total weight right now is these are both 52 and a half, so 105 pounds. I'm not one of those guys that likes doing Bulgarians with one dumbbell. It's just a lot harder to balance that way. I like doing it with two. And you know, I've gone way heavier than this before on these. I've gone up to like 80 pounds on these before. But this is my first time doing them since early spring. So that's almost a year. So I'm kind of just easing myself back into them. And they are fucking hard, okay? They're very hard. The last set might be going to failure. We'll see. I still have to save, or rather conserve, a lot of my energy for the barbell hack squat. But we'll see how this second set goes. Hopefully you guys can see me. But for those of you that are wondering, like Kenny, why don't you just do regular back squats? And I, I have nothing against regular back squats. I used to do them all the time. Okay, when I used to have a more spread out workout split, that was pretty much the only thing I did on leg day. But this new program, I'm doing workouts six days a week, six days in a row and the upper body portion falls right after leg day. Today's Wednesday, leg day, tomorrow's Thursday, upper body. And my main focus here, my main goal, is to just do leg workouts that aren't gonna fucking completely toast my lower back. Because when I do back squats, my lower back is, it, it takes about four days to fully recover. And that's just not practical when I'm doing upper body the next day, arms the day after, and then legs again. Only two days off between leg days. It's just, it's not practical. So hopefully you guys can kind of understand that. And I'm, another reason is that I want to focus my quads. And when I do back squats, when most people do back squats, it develops mostly the glutes, gets quads in there too, but it's mostly glutes. And right now, I want to catch up my quads and my hamstrings. And I did Bulgarians right there, only two sets. That's all I really need to do right there. I actually felt like I was gonna puke after the second set. And again, I want to save a lot of my energy for hack squats. But Bulgarian split squats, that is a great alternative if you're not looking to completely toast your back uh, on leg day because no bars going over, you know, you're holding the weight out front and yeah, they're still very hard too. Like I got a great burn there. So don't discount Bulgarian split squats, you know, the barbell hack squat. The barbell hack squat's been fucking terrific for me anyway. But a lot of people are like, oh, if you're not doing back squat, you know, oh, you're a pussy or whatever. But 
if it doesn't fit your program or it's just not what you're looking to build, the glutes is what I'm referring to, if that's not what you really are primarily focused on building, then fuck what they say. Like, everyone just wants to follow one thing. Tom Platts said, oh, squats. Which, yeah, squats are fucking great for you. Okay? But you gotta weigh the pros and cons and see uh, if it's worth it. And that's what you should be doing with everything in your life, in your training program, work schedule, whatever. Is it worth it? That's what you should be asking yourself. Is it worth it and can I substitute something a little, you know, a little not as good maybe, or maybe just as good and, you know, less taxing on the body. So you, you got to think about those things. All right, hopping into the first set, which is just a warm-up set. Not really actually a set, but just a preset is what I'll call it. And we're not even here. We got it. Oh, there we go. All right. Let's do like five. Five should be good. Ah, uh, uh, ah, 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 Last set of the entire workout. I was only gonna do two of these, but looked in the mirror and I was like, you're a fucking pussy. Nah, I'm just kidding. But I looked in the mirror and I was like, you know what? I got a third one in me. Even though uh, right here, a lot of guys call it a teardrop, it's, it's burning right now. And just being in the squat position, I don't even know why I'm in the squat position before my last set, but just being in that position, it's burning. But let's get into this. Let's finish strong. Fuck. Oh. 
I gotta do this posing very quickly because I gotta get to work. Is it? I'll see you guys tomorrow.